Hello everyone, welcome to this channel. My name is Martino. I'm the founder of the London Saxophone School where we help you master your skills on the saxophone, whether it's with lessons, courses, master classes and workshops and whatnot. So for any kind of question that you might have saxophone related, just let me know here below in the comments and it will be my pleasure to help you out. So today I want to share with you a very cool technique, a super simple technique that will help you improve your sound. Whether you're a beginner, professional or anything in between, this will really help. And you might be wondering, how is that even possible? Beginner to professional with the same technique? Check it out. So I call this the ocean sound just because for me, it just, you know, it reminds me of the ocean and the wind and stuff like that. I'll tell you what it is. But essentially, the most important thing is doing the ocean sound, this will really help you get rid of any tension that you might have inside your body, okay? So you're able to produce a nice note in a relaxed way. So any kind of obstacle that you create in here, you know, will just disappear. And that's the most important thing to create a nice and vibrant sound, okay? Now let's look at three possible scenarios, okay? Now let's look at three possible scenarios in which the ocean sound can help. Now, scenario number one, if you're more of a beginner and you find yourself squeaking a lot and just wondering, how do I get rid of this annoying sounds and noises? So one of the main reasons for squeaking is over tensing on the facial muscles of, of the embouchure, okay? So what you need to do is you need to relax and create more room in here for air to go through and doing the ocean sound will really help a lot. Now, scenario number two, if you've been trying to get those low notes to sound good, but the only thing you're getting is just annoying high notes, so the note is just boom, jumping up like that, so something like this. Again, one of the most common reasons for that is because there's over tensing of the embouchure of the facial muscles, right? You're probably even just, you know, biting a bit too much, clamping in here, just too much happening, it's just forcing. So the note, the only option that the note has is to jump up, okay? And doing the ocean sound will really relax the embouchure and will help you out with that, okay? Now, scenario number three, if you're more of an advanced player and you just, you know, you can confidently play across the range with no issues whatsoever. <laughs> A little bit more in depth you will to refine your sound even further okay doing the ocean sound will really help because get just get rid of any bit of tension that you might have in your body so it's a very slight change that will affect your sound hugely so months ago i did a video explaining how the ocean sound works and how you should practice it but for some reason i don't know why i just never published it so today i want to share that with you stick around to the end because i have a little surprise for you okay so let's watch that together and then i'll see you in a few minutes so let's start with what I call the ocean sound. To go straight into practical terms, the ocean sound is just, it's just this. Okay, you can also picture it as warming up your hands when it's winter. Okay, you're getting warm air, okay. Now the reason behind this is this. You want to allow your sound to start from a relaxed state. Remember that the body, okay, that your body contributes a lot to the quality of the sound on the saxophone, okay? So if you're tense somehow within your body, that's also gonna be reflected in the sound. So doing this, what it does is relaxes your body. The shoulders drop down, the throat opens up, and your facial muscles just, let's say, reset, okay? So the ocean sound is like a reset button, okay? If you're struggling with your sound in that particular day, if you're squeaking, you know, if you're not really happy with the sound for any reason, okay? this will just reset everything and will allow you to get a fuller and a bigger sound, okay? So let's try something together. Now, whether you're on alto or tenor, it's fine, it doesn't matter, okay? We're just gonna play a long B and we're gonna keep that for a few seconds, okay? Now, but before we play the note, we're gonna do the ocean sound, okay? So let's try it. Ocean sound. Okay, now let's play our note. once more and you 
can actually go back and forth between the two, okay? This will really help your sound and when you play, don't really think about the ocean sound or anything else. The body will, will do the work, okay? The body will remember the position of the throat, will remember what to do, okay? This is just a little trick for the brain and trick for the body to help you out with your sound, okay? So try that and let me know how it goes. So see, the ocean sound is super, super simple. It's just like nothing more than warming up your hands. Just like that, okay? But doing this consistently over time will teach your body how to stay relaxed, okay? And over time, this will just become second nature and your body will remember that position that it has to hold in order for you to produce a nice and vibrant sound. It's it's super amazing, okay? But you have to do it consistently. So you can do it before your low notes, before your scales, before any phrase that you're doing. If you're working on sound, just do it here and there, okay? Don't get too obsessed, okay? But your body will just remember, your brain will remember what to do. Just do before you play. Also, just a quick one to let you know that the great American saxophonist Bob Reynolds is going to do a virtual masterclass for the whole saxophone community on April 16th. He's going to talk more about sound and how to make the saxophone sing, among other topics. So if you want to learn more about that, you want to register, the link is here below in the description. So that's all for today. So remember, keep it simple. Ocean sound or Okay, where you just let the air flow, you're not forcing anything out. That's the only trick and then the sound will magically appear, magically, let's say. Okay, it's just a matter of letting the air flow out. That's all, okay? So for more saxophone tips, don't forget to download your free saxophone guide here below in the description, okay? That's also going to give you access to the Music Vault folder, which is just a collection of more free stuff for you, more free saxophone stuff for you, okay? So I wish you a great week. I hope this was helpful. Let me know here in, below in the comments, and I will see you there, and take care. Bye.